Hey guys, what's up, right? Uh, this is Moman from uh, MTRV7 and uh, today I have a video to make for you guys. Uh, in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to unlock your iPhone uh, if you've forgotten the password. Now, uh, the thing is that uh, if your phone is in this situation, if it says uh, your iPhone has been disabled what happened to me because i put in the password but i put in the wrong password when i set it up and i was using face id what happened last night i tried to um access it i couldn't access it uh, so in this case um, there are only there, there's just only one way in which you can basically uh get into your phone and the way is that you need to reset your phone so let's go ahead and show you guys uh, how to basically get into the mode where you can reset your uh, iPhone so for iPhone uh, what you need to do is if you have an iPhone 10 you need to press the uh, volume up key down key and then you need to keep the power button pressed so once when you do that uh, just keep it pressed and uh, wait for like 25 seconds pro approximately and then you'll see a iTunes logo on your iPhone uh, that's the time when you need to connect your iPhone to your uh, to your to your MacBook or to your computer and at that stage it will basically you can choose recovery i'll just show you in a second so just don't forget it's uh you have to press the volume up key uh, leave it volume down key you leave that and then uh you need to press the power key okay uh just let you know guys while you're doing this process what you need to do is you need to connect your um uh, the the lightning cable into your phone and uh, it should give you uh, this logo over here the iTunes logo now um, This is the restore mode and from here on what we can do is we can jump on to the computer and uh, Download the software from there and update it. So I'm just gonna show you in a bit. Okay, right now we are looking at my computer and over here I have uh, the iTunes opened up so when you are at this stage and uh, once you've plugged in your um, your iPhone which is obviously in recovery mode so once when your phone reaches the recovery mode all you have to do is you have to connect it to, uh, obviously your phone will be connected uh, to your uh, to your MacBook or to your computer and over here what you will see is that once you open up iTunes you will get this prompt or this pop-up I'll give you there was a problem with your iPhone that requires to be updated or restored at this stage you need to click restore and after you hit restore you need to click restore and update here your iPhone will be completely erased the data will be erased the only way to get your backup is either from my cloud or the second thing is that if you've uh, backed it up on your MacBook or your or, or this computer which you're restoring it from that is the only way you can get your data back there is no third way all right so I'm gonna hit restore and update so at this stage you'll see uh, on the top right corner of the iTunes application that uh, there is uh, so a software is going to be downloaded so what's going to happen is that uh, over here um, at this stage it will verify your iPhone just like that it'll give you this sort of uh, slim line under the Apple logo and on your on your um, on your MacBook it'll say it's verifying iPhone to restore it so it'll do all this process and me in the meantime you can just uh, you know uh, you can just wait and uh, after this I hope that uh, you'll be able to access your iPhone and same goes in my case as well okay now I've got this prompt your iPhone has been restored to factory settings and it's restarting please leave your phone connected uh, so at this stage uh, just leave your phone connected and wait for a few seconds uh, once the progress bar is again finished um, it should give you a prompt now the prompt will be either you want to restore your iPhone from your iTunes 
or from the iCloud. Uh, but yeah, guys, uh, as I said, I've watched other videos and they say, oh, well, you can restore everything. No, well, you can't restore everything. Uh, the reason being that uh, you need you, you you need to have recent backups either on iCloud or either on your iTunes. So if you don't have none of those, then you are in a big mess. Okay, guys, uh, at this stage you'll you'll see that your iPhone has restarted and you'll get this hello mark. And uh, because this is an iPhone 10, and obviously leave your phone connected and just swipe up and here you can start setting up your iPhone and I'm just going to go ahead and set it up. So yeah, once it gives you this activation lock screen, you have to go ahead and put in your ID and your password. Let's go ahead and click continue. Welcome to your new iPhone that's what is showing me on the iTunes so you don't have to do anything on your uh, on your phone at the moment you hit continue yeah so I'm just connecting to uh, the Wi-Fi because my phone is unlocked and now I'm just setting up it as normal so I'm just gonna set up all the all the features and show you once I come on the home screen so yeah at this stage uh, what will happen is basically uh, uh, it'll ask you it'll give you these options and over here because I haven't backed my iPhone to to the iTunes and what I need to do is I need to restore it from the iCloud and at iCloud I need to put in the uh, my ID and the password and uh, Hopefully, after I've done that, let's see what happens. Okay, um, looks like some success. Uh, just agree to the terms and conditions. And uh, yeah, it's saying it'll take a few minutes and it's checking my ID. Uh, because obviously, I mean, uh, in an iPhone, there are two ways to uh, back up your data. I mean, one is that it automatically backs it up to iCloud, even if you don't buy iCloud. So yeah, so it says no backups available. So this is uh, a bit of a shame that uh, I don't have any backups I'm not sure if I'm I'm gonna literally lose everything or what's gonna happen so yeah guys uh, as I showed you in my case I don't have a iTunes backup and I don't have a iCloud backup uh, but it generally does back a few of your stuff if you're using the same iCloud backup so what you can do is you can just set up your phone as a new phone and, uh, and that should be fine so yeah you can see over here it says no backups available so i'm just gonna set it set up as a new iphone i've got no choice and see what happens so at this stage it'll just tell you that if you want to like you know receive notifications and you want to update your iphone keep your iphone up to date so just press press continue enable location services and it's pretty much the standard setup okay so here we go guys okay so we finally unlocked uh, the um, uh, the iPhone and uh, but the only problem is that I've lost all my data now when I say I've lost all my data I will get my messages and my notes and uh, the calendar back so guys uh, this was my video for um, how to unlock your iPhone if it's showing as uh, passcode disabled hope you guys like this video if you did give it that thumbs up and do subscribe like and share to my videos and I also do giveaways so don't forget to keep on following me on Twitter and obviously on YouTube so guys catch you later then bye bye